every engine on the island of Sodor liked to have a good day, just like Polar Express. But he started to boast about pulling the Express. I'm the most important engine. I get to pull the most important passenger train and- Rubbish! We're all important! It's been like this all day. Polar Express is gonna pull important people around the island tomorrow and he won't stop boasting about it. Why Polar Express? I'm the one for important work. Look at me! I'd rather not, you important work hungry train thing. <laughs> well, you oh, you got my attitude for the official Thomas and Friends show. The next day, Polar Express picked up his coaches to pick up his passengers. Oh, and did he say that he's going to pull important passengers? Well, Polar Express was wrong. Yeehaw! Let's get on this here fine train! Yole yole! What the? No, 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 this gotta be a mistake. You've got the wrong train. No, it isn't. These are the exact people that you'll take around the island, like I told you about. What? You, uh, you said I was gonna take important people around the island. No, I said western people. You must have mistaken. Do you need your hearing checked again? No! Okay, maybe I do. Well, listen carefully, because after you take these people around the island, you have to take a freight train to the harbor. Yes, sir. Express's last stop, he dropped off his coaches at the yard. And coupled up to his freight train. You must get this train to the harbor before the ship leaves tonight. Yes, sir. Be careful, Polar Express! You're not pulling the Express now! Don't go so fast this time! Oh, what do you know? Later, Pole Express was out on the line to the harbor. I'll soon make up for lost time. But the STUPID signalman had forgotten to switch Polar Express off the branch line, and they soon found the mistake. That's strange. I'm on the branch line! Oh no! Express engines aren't supposed to go that way! Wait. That's just a freight train! He can't possibly be an express engine! Oh well. <laughs> Idiot! But it was too late. Polar Express has already taken off. The branch line had old and unsafe rails, but Polar Express didn't realize that he went faster and faster. Oh, help! He then came right off the tracks and through the countryside. Yeah! Sorry, Birdie. Whoa! No one except Birdie was hurt, but Pole Express felt like he had a very bad day. What will Sir Topham Hat say? He found out soon enough. 
I'm very disappointed in you, Polar Express. You know you're not supposed to go on the branch lines. Sorry, sir. You must go to Victor to get repaired. Yes, sir. Polar Express, my friend. What do you need? What does it look like, you little twerp? Whoa, whoa, calm it down, Polar Express. Do you need to be repaired, eh? Yeah, I do. Sorry for the freak out. I guess I'm just having a bad day. Oh, I know how you feel. I'll get you to repair the soon. Thanks. A few days later, Polar Express was fixed and back to work. He felt very sorry for himself. We're sorry you had a bad day, Polar. Yeah, and we're also sorry for sending you up with a freight train to teach you a lesson. What? Nothing. And I'm sorry I boasted about taking Western people around the island. And all the <laughs> engines left. <laughs> well, at least until they were all late for their jobs until Tom and Hack got ready to get them the punishment. <laughs> Wait, what? Nothing. <laughs>